Hey guys, if your backup on iCloud is pretty much full and your iPhone, iPad, or touch can't make one anymore, you might have noticed this when you did the update to iOS 9, it doesn't really matter when, um, let's just uh, reset it, okay? So, when we reset our iCloud, some people think, well, my photos are going to be erased and all that. No, uh, your photos in your camera roll will stay there, uh, so don't worry about that. Your photo stream, you shouldn't worry about that either, however, um, always back up your photos. Uh, you guys, if you want to reset your iCloud, just back them up somehow, okay? So you can just put them on your computer, transfer them, and that's what I always suggest doing so anyways. Um, not just having them on iPhoto or Photos app, uh, but actually backing them up somewhere else, okay? Um, anyway, so let's just get right into it. So here's our iCloud. Now here we see storage. It's 13.7 available. So that's not enough, obviously. That's why we, we've been getting that message that it cannot complete a full backup. So let's just go right into there. And um, what you guys want to do is just tap on Manage Storage. And then whatever you guys have, iPad, iPod Touch, or iPhone, just click on what you guys want to go into. In this case it's this iPhone and um, I have to say the backup shouldn't be this big because this iPhone is pretty clean I don't keep too much stuff on it and I always have a backup on my computer so it should technically not take that much big of a backup but it's doing it so it's okay um, right now the 1.5 gigs photo library is um, not actually supposed to be on it's supposed to be off my photo library but again, that's just something that I suggest turning off usually. Uh, but right now, we're just gonna delete this backup. So let's just press delete backup. And we're gonna turn off and delete. Um, will this delete your contacts and everything on your phone? No, it will not. It's gonna keep everything on your phone. Whatever's on your phone or on your iPad, it's gonna stay there, okay? Um, it will not touch that. It's just gonna delete everything that's on your iCloud. Okay, so let's just do that. We're just gonna try again. Um, sometimes it won't let you do it right away because it was still loading. Okay, so there we go. Loaded, and we're done for, I believe so. Yeah, it's done. Right now, what you guys wanna do is turn it on. So what we're gonna do right now in this page is just scroll all the way down. And you see our backup is off, right? So at this point, just turn it back on. So right here, it's off. Let's just turn it on. There we go. And then it's gonna do our whole new backup. And you can start clean, and you guys are gonna have all good stuff in there. Uh, you guys don't have to worry about space. Just put back up now by yourself. Don't wait for it to back up but do it yourself, okay? Just press on backup like I did. And that's it for this video tutorial. That's how you guys can delete your old iCloud. Um, your photos, well, I wanna show you that my photos are fine, because so, I know some of you were worried about that. But my photos, my photo stream hasn't been touched, that's because it's not really part of my iCloud backup. And uh, my camera roll doesn't really matter, that's in my phone. Same thing goes with contacts and all that. Although there, there is a backup on your iCloud, that doesn't mean it's only on your iCloud, it's also in your phone or your iPad or iPod Touch, okay? Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.